My parents, wanting to have an escapism for my brother and I, decided to enroll us into a summer program over at Martin J. Park. This park in particular is important to me for several different reasons. Some of the events that the park would take the students enrolled into the summer program, they would take them to film premieres over at El Capitan Theater in LA. Some of the movies that I got to watch because of this program included Beverly Hills Chihuahua, Wally, -E, and so much more. Another part of the program that I really enjoyed was how for the people enrolled into the program, those who left early, for my case, it was around 3 p.m. in which my mom, who was working at a local furniture store, got out on time so she could take care of me and my brother. They first got dibs on these computers that they had on the park. Some of the things I would search up constantly when I got to go on these computers were movie trailers at the time. This was around like 2009, so one of the trailers I used to watch all the time back and forth was the trailer for Ice Age Dawn of the Dinosaurs, in which we actually got to go watch it at one of the premieres. Another thing that I searched up on these computers as well at a young age were these poorly made Lego animation videos, were, which at the time, um, filmmaking on YouTube was limited to very choppy video images. and even despite this lack of clear image at times, it's so intriguing with how these animators were so able to produce these type of works on this platform that still hasn't reached its full potential. And so it helped me create a further drive towards movie making and the type of techniques people can use to make these films. Now as an adult, encountering so many different responsibilities such as school, maintaining my grades, staying safe, and everything else on top, I look back at the spark very fondly with how it's a slice of my childhood that I was very much happy about, with how I enjoyed so many different things and didn't have to worry about so many things like I do now. To have been able to go to the summer day camp for so many different years and how I was able to create all these different memories and to grow passions out of all these different years was all due in part because of my parents' it's hard work to stay afloat on top of bills and other responsibilities for my brother and I. They immigrated over to the United States in the early 2000s and have been residing in La Puente for the last almost two decades now. It's because of them that I've been able to go to Cal State Fullerton to have taken the train so many countless times to and from visiting my girlfriend. And even when I didn't even have any money for her, taking the train or to even buy a couple of snacks on the way when I got so hungry in the morning, they would offer me whatever they could. And I was very much grateful for all that money they were able to give me, even when I didn't have any.